everybody, it's Jess here and today I have a video which is all about my absolutely favourite, favourite, favourite mask of all time. So as you can maybe tell, I'm actually filming from my bathroom today, so the acoustics are a little bit off. La, 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 la. And not only that, but I am fighting with the rain. Hello, rain. So let's just move straight on to the mask. Because I have acne, I often get acne scarring. So I've got a few active spots at the moment, but I've also got a lot of scarring still down here and down here, which is basically my problem areas. So what this mask actually does is lighten up those areas and it uses very natural, bare basic sort of ingredients, which is another reason that I really love it. So enough chitter chatter, let's get started. So here are a few things you will need. A small bowl or a plate to mix in, an old foundation brush or something like that, water, lemon juice. This is very important. You can put some in a bowl if you want. It might make things a little bit easier. Bicarb soda, some tea tree oil, which is an excellent antiseptic, and a spoon. And now for the method. You want to add about a spoonful of the bicarb soda. Just put that in the bowl there. If it's a little bit over a spoonful, doesn't matter. Now with that lemon juice, you want to add about half a spoonful of that to the mixture. It will foam up, go a little bit fizzy, mix it all around. It will be quite a thick mixture at this stage. Now for the water, add about half a spoonful of that as well. Mix that all up and you'll get sort of quite a thick paste. You don't want anything too runny because you'll be putting this on your face, you don't want it running down your face. Now. A few drops of that tea tree oil, about five. Mix that all through together. Then you just apply this to the face, concentrating on the areas where you have most of the scarring. So now I've put it all in my face. It's really awkward with the camera there. I'm looking in the mirror, but anyway. So what I've done is I've put it all in my face. If you just have like specific uh, trouble spots, then you could perhaps just put it in those areas. But for me, I like putting on a full mask, so that's what I've done. And I've also brought it right down my neck. If you had like acne across your chest or any on your back or anything like that, you could also use it in those areas. So now we play the waiting game. Green tea! Sam's right as this thing off. It's probably been about 10-15 minutes. Take a well a soft washcloth or something like that and just use lukewarm water. It's a lot better for the skin than using anything hot. Once you've washed your face and you've pat dried it with a towel, your skin might feel a little bit tacky and it might be a little bit red as well. But within a minute that tackiness will just go away and you'll be left with really soft lovely lovely smooth skin and when I used this for the first time I noticed an instant difference in all of my scarring that I had down the sides of my face which is in my problem areas they just faded like so quickly uh, I've still got a lot of scarring I have been using this mask for quite a number of months now and I haven't encountered any sort of serious problems with it if you do then I would just suggest that instead of using so much lemon juice that you do use more water give this mask a go and let me know what you Thing. If you use it, does it have any sort of effect on your skin? And if you've used it a few times, have you noticed any difference in terms of the blackheads on your nose or anything like that? I hope that this video has given you a little bit of help today. If you have any further comments or questions, please just leave them down for me below and I will definitely get back to you. I really hope that you have liked this video today and I thank you so much if you have subscribed as well. It's completely free and it really does mean a lot to me to have your support. I hope that you are having a flip fantastic day and I will definitely talk to you later. Bye! Oh, somebody would rock up to the house when I'm like... Somebody just came to the door when I just put my mask on. Are you for real? That would happen to me. That would happen to me. So, yeah.